and let's go. All right. Oh my god, damn, I hit my my Windows key. <laughs> Are you on Windows 11? Uh, I actually don't know. Do you know how you can check that? Um, I think it's in your settings somewhere. If you go to system, I think it should be. Uh, let's see. I think it goes into about. About, yeah. Uh... Um, let me see. Oh, yeah, down under the Windows specs. It says Windows 11 home. Where does it say that? Uh, go down a little bit more. Oh, I see. Edition. Yeah. Yeah, Windows 11 home. <laughs> Sorry. I only know the way to check it. I didn't... I was like, oh, I could tell you how to check it on the command line, but I don't, I don't remember the exact thing right now. But settings works too. This place is incredible. I feel as though I'm burning up just by standing here. This is Flame Barrel, the Fire Dragon's graveyard. It's where the Fire Dragons who degenerate into savage beasts come to wait for their death. Degenerate, you say? What do you mean by that? I'm not sure if you're aware, but the Dragon Tribe is dying. Those who don't combine their true dragon form out of stone, I bet you lose all reason to become monsters. So that's why they become mannequins. Say, if you know something about the Dragon Tribe, please tell me. If you really want to know, tens of thousands of years ago, the Dragon Tribe settled down on this continent and created a civilization. They, be they possessed intellect and abilities far exceeding those of humans. But suddenly, out of nowhere, their day of destruction came. At first, they couldn't bear children, then they began to lose their minds, going berserk one after the next. The elders warned that the end of the dragons as a species was approaching. There was no longer any way, way to prevent it. However, there was one way they could survive, to discard their identities as dragons and live on as humans. The dragons fell into a panic. Those who believed the elders sealed their forms within stones became humans. But those who couldn't throw away their pride as a dragon, those who adamantly refused to become human, they eventually lost their minds and became not the beasts. As fire dragons before us. Yeah, they're a living example. Not just them, there are many others. But they've all gone feral now. There's no way for them to go back. Worse still, they've been manipulated and degraded. Degrading like cattle by the fire clans who ruled over this valley. Well, Princey, what do you say we get out of here? The clansmen around here ain't friendly. If we hang around, we'll end up as bait for the, for their dragon pets. All right, so yeah, this chapter uh, is very annoying. There's ambush oh, bombs from that come for these forts. We also have a new unit here, Daros. Uh, we'll talk about him once we get him. Uh huh. Uh oh, damn. Okay. Uh, wait, where's? Uh, oh yeah, that's weird. For some reason, I thought the party was effective against these guys. Alright, Thorn is basically just a mini Excalibur if I could crit. It's literally just the Excalibur without effectiveness, and it has 10 to screen. Oh, Maris might actually be able to get the skill. Ah, oh, she's so close. Oh. Okay, just don't crit Paula, please. Thank you. Maybe I can use the. Yeah, I can even use the Lady Sword. Wow, that was a lot of XP. Yeah, these guys are give a lot of experience. All right, so let's have let's see, 18 speed. Okay, yeah, these guys can't double you. So let's see, Fina. Uh, I guess I'll have more stay the tank and take these guys on. See, where do you get the next? Okay, you get the next master in the next chapter. So this master here will go for Merrick, and then the next one, the last one, will go for um, uh, Maris. Okay, yeah, that's a good idea. Because Merrick is higher good. level. Oh Jesus! Oh my God, nice. Ooh, nice. Ah, uh, no crit. Damn. Oh, that Ow. Okay, I'm glad I promoted him. Oh my god, nice! She doubles them. Jesus, he does. Oh god, here they come. Uh, oh god, you gotta be in 18 speed. Yeah, there's no way I'm having to take this guy's home. Uh, maybe I can get a crit? Nope, okay. Uh, actually, that's fine. I can get this guy. Level up, hit point, strength, skill. Nice. All right. Oh, that's a ton of fun. All right. Um, that's the case. 
Yeah, Mark, you're backing off. You're backing off from me. Yeah, Merrick. And now he's level 17. Magic skill speed luck. Nice. He's catching up to Lind. Like I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah, once he once those promotion bosses kick in, he'll definitely catch up to her. Wait, what? Alright, oh, there's this guy. Um I think I'll be fine. Um yeah, okay, yeah, Mary can take that hit easily. And also be careful because they're all gonna be reinforcements coming from the back. Jesus Christ, Fina, can you give oh this to my other guys? Like one of my dancers gets such good level as my healer. Yeah, no suck kidding. Ass. <laughs> Ugh. Ow. Ouch. Why double hit? No, okay. That's why I went because I think the other guys would have. And oh my god, that's perfect. Merrick, go to go to town on him. And another level for Merrick, level 18. Luck and defense. Honestly, I'll take it. Okay, maybe Mary's can get this kill. Just don't crit. God damn it. Alright, level for Mouse. He's now level 6. Hit points, strength, speed. No? Okay, thank you. Alright, nice. Maris gets this kill, and I think I can dance for her and she can kill this barbarian. Alright, level up for Maris, nice. Level 15. Speed and luck, alright? Great, it's something. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not too broken up because the strength cap for Swordmaster is actually pretty low in this game. Mm -hmm. I think it's like 23 or something. <laughs> So where's the next? Oh, the save point's right there, actually. Okay. And I'm gonna move my guys onto these right now because I know yeah. that if I'm not careful, if I get cocky, I just know that they're gonna come. Up. Okay, nice. Paul can actually reach that table. Can reach the fort. Up. Oh, yep. There they are. Oh, there they are. Okay. Good thing I reached the save point this turn. And there's Daros. Oh God. What does that storm master have? Oh my God. What the? Oh, eleven sword. Okay, that's not too scary. But oh, nice. I see drops the silver sword. Alright, so I'm gonna save right now. Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> and, oh my god, damn. I keep thinking the party is effective against these things. Uh, ooh, ho, 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 nice. Ooh. Oh my god, even better. Hey! Damn, Sita. Alright, first level for Sita. Hit points, strength, skill, speed, luck. Oh my god. Ow. Even if I crit, he won't kill. Nope, I don't even care. Okay. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, just don't crit now, Bars. Please. Thank you. Alright, 
go, Mesmeris. And nice. Nice. Alright, level 16. Hit points, strength, skill, red. Wow, she got red. <laughs> That's a 5% chance right there. Oh what the hell? Alright, well, I guess I can just talk to uh, Darius here. Darius, what brings you here? I thought you would wash your hands up your party days. Prince Mars, forgive me. I was looking to start anew, but there would be no place to go for an outcast like me. To resume and continue these crimes is dishon dishonorable indeed. I see. Darius, you cannot stay here. Come with us. Prince Mars, you would ex still accept a fool like me? Prince Knight, this time I'd be changed for sure. Your life is yours. Alright, and with that we get Daros. So Daros is um <laughs> unlike uh Jake, he's uh not good. It seems like Daros gets good base stats, like better base stats than uh, Jake, but he has lower growth rates than him. At least like like he has a good strength growth and an alright speed growth, but he has a good base stats, like he's serviceable, but I just don't think that's worth it. Like Right now, like, he doesn't get doubled by anything, but that's gonna quickly uh -huh. change. And honestly, I just don't think Darius is all that good. Like, I'm... I tried using Berserkers, I don't think they're a good class. Like, in this game, yeah. at least. Because they don't get the crit boost, so they're just basically just, like, they're worth... At least with Warriors, you get access to bows. And the Warriors right. are actually pretty, like, fast in this game, for the most part. Like, any war who's a Warrior is pretty fast. Like, Jake just shows that with his growth rates. And Darius... Yeah, he has a good speed growth, and he has, he has pretty good bow. 41 hit points and 13 defense, that's pretty good. And B rank and axis yeah. is also pretty good at this stage of the, the game. Mm -hmm. Like, that's good. But I just don't think his growth rate to reflect that. I think I'm just going to rate him... I'm going to rate him two stars, and I think that's still generous mm -hmm. for him, because I think that he can contribute somewhat, but if you're going to use, like... You have better axes at this point anyway, too, so I just don't think it's worth using right. him at this point anyway. Yeah. Um, if you thought that I didn't like warriors, well, I actually... I can tolerate warriors. I hate berserkers. I'm gonna just be honest. I do not like the berserker class. Um, and for the exact reasons that you stated, um, I really wish that they had a second weapon type. Um, everyone knows by now, I'm not a big fan of axes. Um, but warriors at least have bows to, to make up for that, you know? Um, they can get some effective damage off, and like you said, they're usually faster, they have some more skill. Berserkers, in my experience, they don't have a lot of skill, they have a lot of strength. As you can see, Daros has 18 strength, that's really good for this point in the game. I would say, if you really like the Berserker class, then, yeah, this is your bread and butter. But, even then, he's... he's okay. Um... I, I'm gonna have. I think I'll give him a two as well, and that's generous mm -hmm. from me. Okay. <laughs> For a berserker. <laughs> I mean, hey, hell, you have to give him credit. Like him and Jay come with good equipment. Like a silver axe. I'll definitely yeah. Take that. Yeah, and his base stats aren't like terrible. I do wish he had more than ten skill. Yeah. But... And I think it, you know that that's for me. That's kind of a standard berserker thing. Is yeah. a lot of strength, some speed, maybe a little defense, a lot of HP, and not a lot of skill. I mean, thirteen defense for a level three berserker doesn't have too bad in my opinion. Yeah, that's pretty good mm -hmm. in my opinion for a berserker. Like usually berserkers, they just have all the health instead of defense. You know. Um. Please, come on. Okay, thank you. Yeah, my favorite... I don't know, usually when I like axe-wielding classes, it's because they have a different weapon type. I don't like mono-axe uh, classes, you know? Yeah. Like, if it's an axe cavalier, well, you know, they're going to become a paladin and they'll get another weapon type. A what? If it's a fighter, then it'll at a least what? become a warrior oh, shit. and get foes. Oh. I didn't realize uh -oh. they were that close. Alright, well, Daros, uh... Cannon fodder. <clears throat> I wonder, will he actually get double? You know, and with, uh, with Wyvern Knights, you know, they usually get lances. Oh. No, I won't. Okay, I, okay, nice. He actually gave his life for a decent cause. Oh my god, he's actually gonna take two hits. Wow. 
I was, was gonna say, watch it backfire. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, he gave his. I mean, he did say Prince Morris's life was his. So, I mean, he wasn't lying. Right. Oh, he shit. did not lie. Yeah. <laughs> he was an honest man till the end. <laughs> we get him just for him to die. <laughs> No, literally, he immediately became cannon fodder. I do feel I do feel bad, like when I lose him. But seriously, like honestly, I'm not using him, so why do I care? All right, so let's see. Uh, oh Jesus! Um, so this guy. Oh, he has a tomahawk too. Is that okay? So I'm gonna get attacked by both those things. Well, uh, I think I can take a hit from these guys. Alright, oh god. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Those are fl those are wyverns. Oh, lovely. Okay, nice shot, Madison. Please get a crit now. Okay. Okay, oh. bars. Uh, bars should be fine. I seriously doubt that Tomahawk can do 19 damage. And if it does, there's something wrong with me. Yep, okay, I had a feeling. Oh, God. Oh, I kind of needed that to hit. Oh, I think that's anybody I can access now. Nice, I can win the hawk there now. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Do this. Gordon Ryan, I need you up here. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, nice. Okay, not. Oh, my God, nice. Oh, wow. That is level three. Hit point strength. Okay, honestly, I'll take it on Gordon. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, I might need Parthia. to. Parthia. Yeah, I gotta use the Parthia here. Is that Fina that had 19 speed? Yeah. Oh my god. She has as much speed as Maris, actually. Jesus. I'm not surprised. That's kind of crazy. I'm not surprised. She has a dancer, so. Yeah. Damn it. Oh my god, these guys are fast. She's one speed off from doubling these dragons. Okay, yeah, I have to bust that Sheeta. Get the first sword on down here. Good. Do I not? Uh, I... Hmm. Okay, yeah, I gotta do it now. Good job, Ryan. Yeah, I gotta use the word to finish off this dragon. Oh my god, nice. Oh. Well, damn. I'm really worried that an enemy's gonna come out from this force right here. Hit points, magic, skill, speed, luck. My god, she has gotten magic, skill, speed, and luck on every single one of her levels from here. Alright, Thorn it is. Oh, nice, we get this double axe. Okay, good. <laughs> Another double axe. I will not say no to that. Alright, don't crit Paula, please. Thank you. That's a kill for Maris right there. Alright, so she is now level 17. Hit points, skill, speed. Nice, she's kept speed. Hey, yeah. Crit 
Mars, please. Thank you. Alright. Oh, God. This is... I am not looking forward to this turn. I swear to God, if reinforces come out now, I'm gonna be so pissed. Game? Okay, thank you. Dodge it now. Oh god, you gotta be kidding me. Fuck. I didn't see that dragon. Do we have Do we have a save state or anything? I have a save point. I did save Okay. Point. Don't worry. We're not too far back. But god damn it, I forgot about that dragon. I swear the movement of this game, like it really catches you off guard. It really does, yeah. Especially since we just came from a GBA title. Yeah, like seriously, like, like, how, like, Flyers having ten move in this game, and the dra yeah. the dragons having like fucking twelve, and the wyverns having wyverns having twelve, like, that's Tellius levels of movement right there, you know? Yeah. Yeah, and I got a really good level of some of my guys, too. Damn. What? Oh, just like we're so far back that we didn't get Taros yet. Yeah, don't worry. No, Man like, gets a second chance at life. Well, Never mind. <laughs> depends if it, I, I can. I don't blame you. What the, the real? Oh wait, right. They came back next turn. <laughs> yeah. Ow. All right. Well, this gives me a chance to actually like retreat then. Thirty-five minus eleven. Okay, she won't die. Okay, now they come out. Wait, oh, no, wait. They... oh nice, he backfired. Oh. Nice. All right, now that actually <laughs> saves me some trouble. We take. Oh my god. Okay. He has a war dog, so I'm not surprised. <laughs> Hit points, strength, skill, speed, luck. Nice. Nice. Do I cast speed just now? Oh my god, nice bars. Damn. Oh my god, damn. I'm doing way better this time. Oh, okay, thank you. I don't think he would have died, but still, that's a body dodge. Though. Oh, nice. That is, oh my god, this is perfect. Let me see. 33 minus 14. No, I actually would have loved that. Oh, nice. Yeah, I just kept speed. Nice. Alright, I'm gonna grab some water real quick, because um, this is what happens when you don't stay hydrated, by the way. So, stay hydrated or else. <laughs> yeah, I do. Okay, yeah, I do have some water. All right, well, this shouldn't be too hard. I mean, I have cleared up most of the enemies here. All right. Ryan, thank you. I know I'm focusing on long game Maris' experience, even though she doesn't get remastered until the next chapter, but still, if I can get any experience on her, I will take it. And level 17, hit point. What? Maris. Come on. Alright, Paula, come on. Ow.
Okay, I flew straight up. Thank you, Sita. Strength, speed, luck. Nice. Oh my god, I am so lucky with how much strength she's got. Usually, Sita does not get that much strength in this game. Because of only having 30% strength. I do want to take out this dragon. Actually, I have to take out this dragon. What am I saying? Let me see. This dragon does 35 minus 11. Okay, Maris won't die from this. Oh, nice. Okay, thank you. Oh, beautiful. Alrighty. Oh, you're back? Damn, that was quick. Yeah, I also have some uh, cough drops. Because <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, wow. Okay, thank you. Now you dodge. Okay. Crits, Merrick, or me, Rock, Gordon, God damn it. Alright, well, it's a Lola for him. Let's see. Hit points, luck. Alright. Oh my god, I'm so scared. Okay, I'm gonna have to move my ass up to that oh, same point. It's better than just health, because I have a standalone mic now, but I, I have Bluetooth headphones. Did Maris get just a HP level up? Yeah, she didn't get. Is yeah, that she, what I heard? Yeah, she didn't get up. She didn't cap on the uh, speed mm. this time. It's fine though. She's just Damn. one point off. Yeah, I'm sure she'll get it next level. Knock on wood. Even if she doesn't, she's still at 19. So. Yeah. Okay, nice. Okay. Oh wow, there's only eight enemies left, but I know that number's gonna change like mm -hmm. radically. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use the save point here. I got an eater Reese's and it was so good. Reese's? Wait, what? I'm, us I'm usually not a big Reese's fan. Oh. But oh, Reese's. Oh, you mean like the candy? Okay. Yeah. I, I ride a Reese's just now and it was really good. I, I don't know why. The only Reese's I eat, or Reese's Prime I eat, is the um, uh, Reese's Take 5. Oh, it, yeah. Yeah, we were talking about that. Right. Oh, yeah, right. I think we were talking about like an episode or two back. Yeah, the Reese's take fives. They didn't Because that's what they sounded really good. They weren't always owned by um, uh, Reese's though. They used to be just their own product. Yeah, I've only had just the, like, when it was just said, when it just said take fives. Yeah, that, but that, those are the only ones I've had. Those, those were years ago. Back when I think, I was like, the last time I think they were like that, I think it was like when I was 14 or 15. Mm -hmm. Damn, almost nearly oh, wow. a decade ago. I am so old. <laughs> Let me tell you though, 100 grand bars, I know I said this last time too, 100 grand bars are god, if you like chocolate and caramel, they're the best. Cause let me tell you, Snickers are the most mid candy bars out there, right? But 100 grand, it's like a crunch bar on the outside and like caramel on the inside. So if you like Rolos, you'll really like them. Um, but another candy that I really like that's not chocolate is Chewy Spree. I like regular Spree too, but Chewy Spree, so good. Oh yeah, I think you were talking so about Spree good. as well last time as well. <laughs> yeah, probably. I can never find the Chewy kind. I can only ever find the regular kind. Man, I know I just said that Snickers were really mid, but now I really want one. <laughs> But then again, I usually don't, like, eat Reese's a lot, and I just had Reese's, and it really smacked, so could just be the, uh, the illness. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, you got me. Oh, jeez. That is a lot of wyverns. Okay, I'm glad I moved, actually. It had to be wyverns, too, and not just dragons. Hey. Well, I should kill most of the guys here if the AI is how I think I am. Hello, for Massey, he's now level 8. 
hit points, skill, defense. I'm really worried about Kala here because there's another drone. Ooh. There's a wyvern in range here. Just don't kill him. Okay, nice. I think I'm fine. Oh. It's fine. Uh, yeah, I should be fine. Ow. Okay, here comes the Pisces. Oh my god, that's a lot of dragons. Luckily of how the map is designed- Oh, you got- I can't reach that guy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god, these dragons. This is why I hate Wyvern so much. Okay, we'll see if they can reach that guy. They guys. suck. So annoying to fight against them. Twelve move. And they have one to two range too. Hit points, skill, speed, luck, defense. Damn. Well, I can take these guys out no problem with Merrick. And I think I will actually. Oh, nice. Oh wow. That is literally a hundred and fifty-nine damage right there. Jesus. Oh yeah, he's so he's so good. I'm just assuming. He's so close. Ah, oh, I'm one damage off. Wait, what? Oh, okay, I thought I was like the part that only does 17 damage. And, oh, damn it. Hit me, hit me. Okay, I gotta use Aura. Damn it. Damn. Guys are bulky. Damn, they one shot Lin too. All right, so she's now level four. Magic skill, speed, luck again, and we get the Pisces. Hey. So the Pisces <clears throat> gives one defense and res. Oh wait, that's why that guy was hard to kill. I should work these guys actually. Okay, good. Whew, they're not in range. Okay, yeah, I gotta kill this guy. And a Volnery, nice. Finish out this dragon, and I think Mazen has the move to actually reach that other fort. If not, I'm gonna be in a bit of a bind. All right, Merrick is now level 19. Yep, hit points, skill, speed, luck. Nice. His stats have been really turning around. Mm -hmm. I, I was worried actually when I first got. Yeah, him. I'm. I'm very oh, pleased with how he's turning out. Shit, he can't reach. Oh no, that's not good. All right. Oh wow, okay. That's not good. Um, Mark, please get a really good level up now. Hit points, skill, luck, defense. Okay, I guess I'll take the... I guess I'll take it. Oh, they go for bars, okay. Ow, uh, Ooh. don't kill, please. Okay, nice, he doesn't double. Point strength, skill, speed. Nice. Oh my god. Hey. Okay, nice job, Mark. Oh, nice. Dodge. Thank god they do not have one to two range. Now, these guys. Oh god. Okay, that's a kill. Impala re okay, nice. Okay, Paula can't double that one. Okay, I might be able to kill these guys. Thank God for Excalibur. Plus almost a level up. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, I use the Fusro Da here. Oh my god, even a crit? Damn. Oh my god. It saves a use. And I can trade it over to Paw and she can kill this other uh, wyvern. Yep, there we go. Nice. Perfect. She misses. <laughs> oh, nice. That one point has to be actually some double now. Oh. Alright, nice. I'll take it. And the dodge, too. Yes, but I can't. Oh, use it. she can't use it. Ah, oh, damn! Why did I do that? Oh no! I shouldn't have attacked. Oh. Mm -hmm. God, Madison, you are a titan. The madman. Hit point, strength, skill, luck. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna like, Jesus Christ. I cannot. I should not. I should just. I did. I did something. All this stuff is the boss now. Alright, level for Fina, level 12, hit points, skill, speed, luck, defense. Nice. Oh nice, and that guy can't attack from range, so he's literally so easy to kill. Oh j what the hell? He doubles Marth? Oh my god. So I should be able to do some decent damage to this guy with uh, Merrick, and then I can be able to kill the Maris. Alright, that's the Captain Merrick now. Hit points, speed, defense. Oh my god, damn. 11 points on my mage. <clears throat> that's kind of crazy. Master Seal of America. Oh wait, damn it, that's not enough. No. Alright, level for Maris, level 18. Hit points, strength, skill, speed. There we go, now she's got speed. Alright, well. 
There we go. Thanks. Damn, nice. Alright, let's actually cap him right now. Let's actually promote him right now. Alright, Merrick class change to Sage. Wonder how his promotion bonus will be. Oh my god, he gets a lot of HP. Let's see. Six hit points, two change, two magic, one skill, one speed, one defense, and two res. B rank and Thomas and E rank and saves. Honestly, his stats are not that bad compared to Mims, actually. Like, he has. Like, let's see. He has. Better defense. He basically has better, like, defense. He's basically more defensive than Lim, actually. Other than that, they're not too, like, far apart from one another. Okay, I'm just gonna get more, like, as much as grace as I can. Ah, uh, so close. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, wait, no, actually. There we go. Alright, level 5 lens. So, skill speed. Alright. Alright, so I've gotten everything. Yep, alright, let's get out of here. Oh god, I, I'm so glad we're done with this chapter. But we are not done with the dragons yet. Phew, and that'd be the end of the Fire Dragons Valley. How you doing, Princey? I'm fine, I think. Zane, I believe you said that there were other Feral Dragon tribes. Yeah, in addition to this vibe, there's the Wyvern's Dale, the Ice Dragon Trite, and the Dragon's Altar. The Dragon's Altar? It's a dragon graveyard in the mountains of Macedon. There the dra Earth Dragons sleep. A long time ago, thousands of years ago, in fact. The mighty Earth Dragons also reminds me of the humans. Of course, the humans barely stood a chance. Most were annihilated, and the rest pushed into the desolate corners of the continent. And then, the Divine Dragon Naga, strongest in the law, waged a war for humanity. It was a fierce battle, but Naga emerged victorious in the end and sealed the Earth Dragons below door in a deep sleep. And so that, that power that so that the power of the seal would not wither, she created the shield of the five orders and placed it in the fan of her mind. I see, I understand now. In other words, our guardian deity Naga depicted in legend was the divine dragon that saved humanity. But then what about the divine sword Vulchin? Naga took pity on you humans with no way of protecting yourself, so she created it from one of her fangs. Then together with the, key, the shield, she sealed it in the faint and had the remaining dragon houses watch over humanity. She put the newly born Tiki to sleep and thus ended her 5,000 year life. Because of all this, because of all this, God is trying his best to carry out Naga's orders. What, Zane, are you telling me? Yes, God owes the divine dragon, and guess what? So am I. Blast, the sea is absurd. I wasn't sweating this much in the desert. I'm usually tolerant of heat, but this is simply unbearable. Madison, you seem... You seem... Your face, are you not hot? I have confidence in my strength. Sir Jing, it seems our companions are catching up to us. I'll go and carry them over here. What strength oh is though you're invulnerable. Your reliability is astounding. Too true. All right, these guys. I love these guys. Please pardon oh. my son and this, but might you be Prince Moth? Who are you? I am Belle. The, these men here are Robert and Lightning. We rushed here because we wished to join your battle. We were once nice of the Sable Order of Ghosts, but we have now separated from our homeland. We threw our, away our ranks as knights and now live to protect those who are powerless. The Sable Order of Grus, but in the previous war we fought against the Sable Order as, as enemies. Despite that, you will then join our army? Our general wished for us to protect the weak, regardless of nationality. He is gone now, so we, mu would, so we would like to fulfill his final wish. I see, you seem to speak truly. Very well, I'd like you to fight alongside us. Alright, so let's... I forgot about them. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you. We'll talk about them now, and then we'll make a count, and then we'll do the next chapter, and then I think we'll end it for the day. We'll save the, um, okay. the guy in chapter for, like, next time. Sounds good. Alright, chapter 13. Frozen Land, right. Ice Dragon Shrine. Not the Ice Dragon, that tr not the Ice Dragon Altar yet, because that's the next chapter. Oh, no boy. This was truly a journey beyond all imagination. 5,000 meters. No, perhaps even higher than that. The clouds already below them, they ascend the frozen mountain. Suffocation. Vertigo. They were already approaching the limits of their strengths. Well, Madison, is everyone making good use of the drill grounds? Of course, if you win often, you'll be that much stronger. Madison, you... Hmm, you seem you haven't won much yet. Are you purposely avoiding the drill grounds? 
So, sorry, I don't really have the money, so... Well, it's fine if you're not struggling now, but when things get tough, that experience will be the clincher. Just remember, if you ever feel that your foes are too strong, there's a, there's a place where you can hone your skills. Well, Jake, if I don't have the money, then how am I supposed to go to the draw grounds? Like, right. It's a double-edged sword, man. No kidding. All right, so yeah, now we have the ice uh, dragons. So you thought so? The ice dragons are basically, in my opinion, like they're almost as bulky as the fire dragons, but they hit as hard as the wyverns, though, because mm -hmm. of their ice breath, which is pretty scary. Um, also, this chapter is a gain chapter requirement. You have to basically um, complete it in how many turns? You have to be in. Uh, you have to be in uh, twenty-one turn. No, wait, that's the last. Uh, twenty-eight turns actually. Or you need to kill both of these thieves and then you just get the game shot. Which I have to say, that's a pretty easy one. Like, the side objectives mm -hmm. are so easy to complete as opposed to the turn requirements. Like, kill two thieves and you just get a guy in chapter. <laughs> it's so easy to, to, like, achieve. Yeah, they really want you to get the guide in chapters. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, don't get me wrong, like, the guide chapters are fun, and, like, they, like, they're mm -hmm. fun. I'm not gonna say they give us good news, but they are fun. And here's Maris's Master Seal. This is the last one, and Jesus Christ, this guy is in a league of his own. Compared to these other dragons. Like, oh my Jesus god. Christ. Is he double Marth? Uh, no, he doesn't. Okay. Uh, also, we're facing, uh, Dark Mages. Honestly, I don't really get the point of Dark Mages. I think they're just supposed to be bulky, because... Compared to other mages, like, they don't really offer anything. Like, they can yeah, both no, use state. Don't. Like, there's no dark magic in this game. Well, there is, but only when we can use it. Alright, so let's pick and choose our units. Are there anything to zero one? Yeah. I, yeah, I guess we're not bringing serious anymore. <laughs> Damn. Ouch. Because I just don't have the slots. Like, I'm, like, the max you can bring is, like, 12. And, like, when you get 12, like, he's kind of, like, obsolete. Right. <clears throat> this is basically my go-to team. I mean, why, why would I mess with the works? Alright, so, oh my god, we have a lot of star shorts to give out. Um, yeah, no kidding. I guess I can get the Aquarius out. Um, do I have one that can boost? Uh, let's see, I have the Pisces. I guess I'll give the Pisces to Eric to have all his defenses. Fina, okay, actually, you know, I'll give a bunch to Fina to help her out. Let's see. Um, Aries, Vertigo, and I guess I'll give him Libra. And then finally, I can give the Sagittarius to. Uh, I guess I can give it to. No, I... Uh, I guess I'll give it to Lind, actually. There we go. Uh, let's see. How's everyone? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, we have to talk about these guys. So let me actually pull their growth rates. <laughs> these guys. Let me see. Uh, okay, I guess I'll just go through them like that. Later. So yeah, first up we have is Robert. Uh, he's a pre-promoted horseman, and as far as Robert goes, he actually has like, um, I think he's like the most min-max guy here. Like he has 65 and like strength, de uh, skill, and speed. Um, his defenses are like non-existent as you would expect. And pretty good luck. I think the reason why his growth rates are a step above Belf and Light is because he's pre-promoted. And as far as the level 3 horseman goes, I mean, he's alright. I mean, d rank is a little bit low for my thing, but he has c rank and bow. So if you need a good bow user and you don't want to use your hunters, uh -huh. uh, I think he's pretty good. Like, he's got a good bolt too, like 32 hit points and 8 defense. Uh, I just don't think that horsemen are all that good in this game. <laughs> Like, that's just my opinion. I just think that snipers mm -hmm. are better. Uh, yeah. I don't really have much to say about it. I mean, Robert's okay, in my opinion. Um, I think I'll just give him 3 out of 5 stars, because he does actually, like... I mean, he does need some work, but I think he's, like, decent for... Like, I think 3 stars is generous for him, but I think he's decent for what he brings to the table. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think he's a decent option. Like you said, if you didn't train either of your hunters up, and you really need a horseman, like, for whatever reason. Um, he's not a bad option, he's just not really a good option either. Um, I would like to see something better than C rank and bows and D rank and swords in a promoted unit. Um, especially seeing that Belf and Leiden also have a C and a D rank. Uh, you would think that a promoted unit would have higher than that. Yeah, plus you got, like, you just got Darius who had B, and then you had Jake who had C rank yeah. both axes and bows. Right. And it's just like, 
pretty sure I've said this before, but this game throws a lot of calves at you. <laughs> and we just and got I just think, three more. I know. We just got even more. And I just don't think Rabbit really sticks out. Yeah, um, I'm going to give him a 2 out of 5 stars. He's just not really that great. Yeah, that's the problem with this game. When you have an oversaturated concept like the Cavs mm -hmm. in this game, it's very hard to see any of them work. Right. And we're not done. We're like, we're not, like, seriously, we're going to get a lot more cats than these guys pretty soon. Yeah. Like the Wolf Guard, and we're also going to get Oh, Able. my God. Like, you get so many. Yeah. Next up is Belf. Um, personally, I prefer Belf over Light in my opinion, mostly because Belf has, like, pretty good base stats for level 15, like 14 strength, 15 uh -huh. skill. So he is a little bit low, but he also has, like, 12 defense, so I think he's all right. Um, in comparison to Lion, he's basically the stronger of the two, whereas Lion's like the faster. But I do think that Belf is like better. I actually think Belf is like like out of all of them, if I already used one, I do think Belf is the go-to choice because like like Lion, Belf's speed isn't like too bad, but Lion's like strength is a bit of a problem, and I do prefer to like have strength on my cows as opposed to like speed. And plus, Belf, you, just, you also got like a bunch of sound boosts. So, if you did want to use Belf, I'd personally hold off on a speed wing to give to him that you got from that uh, desert treasure map. Um, and then uh, after that, like, yeah, I think he's on par with the rest of your team. Like, honestly, these are not Belf and Linen are not bad. And I do think that, like, if you're going to, like, honestly, they, they have the woman race to work. I think I'm just going to rate them both three stars as well because. They're both, they're mainly interchangeable. Like they have like slight differences in growth rates, but if you really want to know, um, Belt basically just has, is basically faster than Lightning, whereas Lightning, or no, Belt's actually stronger than Lightning by 5%, whereas Lightning's um, faster than Belt by like 10%, and right. same with skill. Other than that, they are literally the same in terms of- I love how this game was just like, hey, I heard that you liked Kane and Abel, so I gave you like another cannon able that's already three more up. pairs of them. <laughs> I gave you a Luke and a Roderick. I gave you a Belf and a Layden, like, and there's more coming. Um, yeah, I'm also just gonna rate them both three out of five stars. They're kind of interchangeable. It's just up to preference. If you like the cannon archetype better, you're gonna like one better. If you like the able archetype better, you're gonna like the other better. Yeah. Um, it's. I feel like they're just throwing carbon copies of different calves at us. They're like. Hey, we're pretty sure that by now you've probably lost a bunch of your calves. <laughs> so here's some more. Yeah. And also, like, another thing is that, um, in case you didn't know, he's actually, Robert's local his name is Roberto, which I find is, like, I think I like Robert Roberto, actually. Yeah, I like Robert better. Yeah. Also, like, also another thing, in case you guys don't know, these guys are from the Arcanea saga, which... You know, mm -hmm. that's why, like, that's why it seems like they're so random how these guys appear. Like, they appear in the fire. They're just like, hey, alley. bro. <laughs> like, it seems so weird for them to show up there of all places. That's why I was like, oh, wait. <laughs> like, I don't remember that. Yeah. I mean, they really wanted to make everyone in here. But when mm -hmm. you do a game like this where everyone comes in, like, it just feels like so random. And uh, also, oh, call wait. it Smash Ultimate because everyone is here. Yeah, it's like Smash Ultimate. Everyone <laughs> is here. Everyone. Uh, I don't think there's um, uh, any. Is uh, there any in this chapter? No, I think it's the next chapter. I got really... Yeah, I think it's. The... Oh, God, we're still not done with the waifus. All right, back. I forgot about it. We have to talk about him when we did this chapter. Oh, wait, right. I think the, I think the money's in the chest, actually. Alright, so we picked our units. Uh, let me just rearrange the. Um, I want my flyers to actually go and take down those thieves immediately. Yeah, so I think. Yeah, yeah, okay. This shouldn't be a problem. Alright, so let us save. And we also have to talk about. We also have to do talk. Damn. Okay, we don't have that many. Alright. Thanks to the heroic per people of Altea who stood up to protect the princess, the people of Arcadia came to show, sh came to know she was alive and resumed their battle against Dol. The, the Liberation Army was led by Duke Carter, Cartas, who fought with the royal shield given to him by Artemis. And thanks to their efforts, the tides of battle turned into their favor. However, the king of the Earth Dragons, Medius, finally decided to make his move. Medius, before his overwhelming might, it seemed like Altea's resistance would wouldn't last any longer. But then a sage appeared before them. He spoke of a divine sword shrine in the ice shrine in the distant north. 
With that blade, it would be possible to fell minis, but the way to obtain it would be by no means easy. And that would be Henri's way. The way we're going through right now. Okay. Current status. <laughs> We've passed through the Desert of Death and the Fire Dragon's Graveyard. The last of Henri's way leads to the Ice Dragon Shrine. If we obtain the life serum from, from the Lord God, we'll be able to combat the Dark Serum that controls Harden. And then we might just be able to reclaim Altea and save Harden. Okay. Martin Cedar 3. Nice. nice. Sita, have you been well? <laughs> huh? Why did you laugh? Was it something I said? No, not really. It's just, you always ask me that. You're always worrying about everybody else. Is that so? That's why we follow you, Marth. It's because of your kindness that I... Huh? Say, Marth, once this war is over, will we... Yes, you must devote all of our energies into the reconstruction. Oh, yeah. That's right. And then we'll be wet. Oh, Marth. I'm looking forward to seeing you in a wedding dress, Sita. And what, sir, will I do if it becomes me less than this armor? <laughs> That's impossible. You'll be beautiful regardless. Really? Mm. Thank you, Marth. I hope I'll be a bride worthy of you. I too. I'll make you the happiest woman in the world, Sita. Marth. Alright, nice. Alright, let us save. Let me just make a cut here, and let's go. We are still not done talking. Jesus. 